Well, Robin Biro is a former regional director for Barack Obama's 2008 presidential campaign. He joins us. Hey, Robin, thanks for coming on. Hey, thank you so much for having me, Tucker. It's Look, I back. think it's important to have an open mind. I've you know, never been a friend to Russia or anything like that, but this has gone on over a year, and it's prevented government from doing the things the government ought to do, this investigation. And so I think it's fair as a citizen to say, what do you got? Like, what's this about? You're accusing people of treason, betraying their country. And the only thing that I've come up with in looking at it pretty carefully is this dossier, which is, you know, prima facie flawed. Is there anything else at the bottom of this? Well, yes, you know as, uh, as well as I do that to obtain a FISA warrant, you have to have at least 10 forms of, of evidence, of corroborating evidence. Uh, that was just one of them. And, uh, you know, Comey was correct well, to call parts others? of it salacious. Uh, we don't know whether that investigation is still ongoing. We haven't been okay, privy okay, to that. Okay, but, and there's but five other investigations. Right, right. Tons of invest. I mean, that's all we do in Washington is stage investigations. Right. And look, at a certain point, you think that's fine. I get it. The allegations out there get to the bottom of it. But this is the basis of a partisan war right now. And at some point, the rest of us have a right to like, what exactly are you talking about? So you've got the dossier. What else is there? Can you point to a single other fact that suggests actual collusion between the Trump campaign and the government of Vladimir Putin? Now, you're a smart man. You know as well as I do that FBI investigations do not work like that. We are not privy to ongoing information from those investigations. Oh, no, 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 but there are we congressional that, investigations. We know that people have been charged. We know that there have been charges, but none of the charges uh, have anything they're... to do anything to do with collusion with the Russian government. I mean, you had two people charged for things they did long before the campaign, and two others charged for lying to the FBI. I mean, and let's be real; we both know what that means. It's not a real thing. So let's honestly, like the whole leadership of your party is accusing people of betraying their country. Do we have any evidence that's real? Like any. I want to go back to the very first thing that you said uh, st uh, struck a chord with me because as a veteran, I had the same oath to uphold the Constitution that our federal agents do. So they're just doing their jobs to uphold our way of democracy. But I'm, I'm not attacking our federal agents. Well, well, so, so I'm, sure. I'm not attacking them. I, I'm talking about our leaders in Congress, our elected leaders who have gone yes. way out on a limb accusing people they disagree with politically of working for a foreign and hostile nation. And I think now after a year, more than a year, it's fair of me to ask, what are you talking about? Do you have any evidence that that's true? And as I said, the only piece I can see is the dossier, which I doubt you will defend because it's impossible to defend. So is there something else? That is forming the, the basis the of these allegations. Is salacious. Yes, there. Like I said, there were at least nine other forms of corroborating evidence. We are not privy to that information because it's an open FBI investigation. So, and do we, you believe the, the public what, is not? What, what percentage of that? FISA warrant requests are granted? by FISA judges. Do you know? It's something like 98.2 percent. Right. And I agree that's in, that's a lot. And I'm just okay. being honest. So so what? It, it's a lot. It, well, it's uh, it's obviously fake. I mean, if it's you know, it, it's like an Albanian election under Enver Hoxha, like, you know, you get all the votes. So I think it's fair for me to ask, like, what was the evidence? You're you've stopped our government from working. Why are you doing that? Do, what do you know that we should know? about Trump's collusion with Russia? And the answer is there's nothing. It's this dossier. This is all a bad joke. Yes. That it, uh, then what else is there? That's one of, I don't want to be so redundant, but it's one of at least nine other forms of corroborating. Can, can, we don't can you name any of the nine? Or, can you name any no, of them? No, because well, it's, it's an open but FBI you just, investigation. Okay, so you have faith I, that not, they exist. I'm not a, I don't work at the FBI. No, I, right. They I, have understand, to. I understand. They have to. In order to get a, to get a FISA warrant, they have to exist. Even though those, over those 90 percent of war, even though over 90 percent of warrants are granted, which suggests the process isn't real, and you don't need real evidence yes, to get one. Okay, so but Every we should all just analyst have... that I've heard says that these that these FISA warrants are between sixty to ninety pages. So it can't just be this oh, salacious. So dossier. they're long, therefore they must be true. Is that what you're saying? I no, mean, you're I, just asking I me to have a lot of faith in a system, system that clearly needs some scrutiny and oversight. And I and I hey. wonder why I can't have some facts. 
<laughs> because it's an open investigation. I can't make that any more oh. clear. But okay. I want to point out the GOP right. is the party of law and order. I feel that this is an attack on the preeminent uh, law enforcement agency in the oh, country. Oh, right. And, and, no, no, no. You feel that that's a talking point that Democrats set out this morning, but it's not going to work on this show because I, didn't even know I actually do believe in law and order. And in order to believe in it, I need to know that the people administering it are on the level. And therefore, I have a then right Tucker, to ask should... honest questions. And I'm not getting any I, yes, honest answers. Of course. Okay. Because there are, it's an open investigation. I mean, right. what, okay, what then do you want? My last question then, since you don't know what this investigation is based on, only the FBI does, and no one making these allegations knows either, can we agree that nobody should accuse anybody else of being a tool of a foreign government until we get that data, those facts. You better believe it. I, I, I agree with you wholeheartedly there. Amen. I do not like that this has been made a partisan issue. Yeah. I just want them to do their job. If President Trump is so innocent, let this be run and so, let this go unimpeded okay. and have himself be exonerated. He is innocent because we're all innocent until proven guilty. I, wouldn't you guys forget this stuff? Amen. Robin, thank you. Good to see you. Thank you so much.